positively Jax, a special honor for an Orange Park High School football star today. Yeah, news for Jack Sports anchor Cole Pepper was at Orange Park High School today where Roderick Kearney received a very special jersey. Cole? Yeah, this was neat. There it is. There's the jersey itself. Maybe a little snug for an offensive lineman like that. Uh, it was his jersey signifying that he'll play in the Under Armour All-America game. It's a rare honor as well. Since the game began in 2006, only two other high school football players in Clay County have made the team. Oak Leaf's Jack Quarterman, who's now playing for the Jaguars, and Fleming Island offensive lineman Ian Silberman, who spent five years in the NFL. That goal is a long way off for Kearney, but he certainly is off to a good start in his football career. He's been considered a star since his sophomore year when he was a starter for the Orange Park High School team. He verbally is committed to play his college ball at Florida State and told me today that uh, the teams that they face have been moving their best pass rusher away from him this year. He's developed quite the reputation. Even still, he was very pleased to become the first Under Armour All-American in Orange Park High School's history. When I first found out, it was a, it was a, I was very excited. You know, I worked hard for this. Uh, went to countless camps, All-American camps, uh, getting MVP. It just showed me that I wanted more when I got it. Uh, it's, it's been a really good experience. Who's most excited about you getting, getting this, uh, this honor? Uh, I would say my mom. You no, know, she 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 been through here, through the journey a lot. So we went down countless days of online schoolwork, um, sweating, getting my body getting my body recovering. They should definitely see what hard work uh, can get them. You know, everybody should strive for that level of success on and off the football field, and it should be good for everybody. Is it hard or easy to coach a guy who's got this kind of acclaim and going to Florida State and all that? Uh, it's not hard because they're, they're pretty much self-driven. So, um, you know, those are the kind of guys you want to coach. Kearney plans on graduating early in December. Then he'll play in the game on January 3rd in Orlando. And then he's going to enroll in college for the spring semester.